What's up, guys? Uh, Bungie just put out another TWAB about an hour ago. Um, we're going to be listing the main parts that I thought were more important because I'm not going to read through the entire thing because that would just take too long. Um, but here are the main, uh, the main things that caught my eye. So to, conden to condense all this down, basically weapons are getting a, uh, like all, most weapons are getting new re uh, reticles and weapons like uh, Lumina with Noble Rounds are getting like a, like, a, like a counter underneath to let you know how many Noble Rounds you have or how many, how many Memento Mori shots you have for Ace of Spades. So that's, that's nice. Nice little um, uh, quality of life change. Um, Fusion Rifle and like Sword Guards are also getting charge meters as well as Devil's Ruin, Salvation's Grip, Grand Overture. They're getting charge meters as well. Um, let's scroll down here. Here's a big one. Full Auto Melee is coming next season. So um, just like how the Full Auto Firing was a big change for every weapon to use Full Auto, um, you can get that with a Melee. So uh, Titan Mains out there, rejoice, finally. We're going to get um, this Auto Melee, just bop, 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 you know, nonstop punch in action. Uh, I'm so happy about that. Um, uh, they nerfed submachine guns in PvP. Uh, the damage is down. The Immortal in particular got its range reduced by 10, a value of 10. So that's, that's, I mean, that's fine with me. I don't play PvP that much, but I know the Immortal was kind of a monster. Um, sniper rifles, uh, they're all getting a buff in PvE, a 10% damage buff, except for Izanagi's Burden, unfortunately. But, I mean, that's okay. Izanagi's is already insane. Um, let's scroll down here. Um, uh, just some random buffs, some random nerfs. Graviton Lance is a big one, increasing the damage and crit. Um, pretty good. Uh, Manticore, um, you get even more damage resistance when you're flying around, and you get increased movement speed because otherwise you you kind of felt like a moving or a sitting duck uh, while using the Manticore in my experience. But uh, that should make it a little bit better. Uh, you get an extra noble round on Lumina, which is nice. Um, word line zero sprinting heavy attack can now be chained into itself once, so that's pretty good. I don't know what that means really. Here's my favorite thing of the entire of the entire TWAB. Sweet business is getting a massive buff. Um, every twenty s shots, it fires explosive rounds. Fewer shots while fu fully spun up. So, so imagine just putting on acting war rig and running out there. Sweet business that actually might be a viable option. There's just you know you. Explosions make everything better. Just add explosions to every every gun in the game, and it just I'll be fine by me. <laughs> um, Tommy's matchbook is getting scorched, which is nice. Um, no time to explain. His little little arc buddy, uh, you know, works against barrier shields and stuff. Pretty cool. Skyburner's oath is um, scorching a little bit more now. Salvation's grip fully changing that. Uh, it's getting a secondary fire mode that um, shoots like a normal grenade. So. Uh, the first mode you shoot crystals pop up second fire mode you shoot if you break all three of those crystals you get a round refunded like just automatically reloaded into your into your mag which is cool um so big big buff by salvations bad juju is getting a recoil buff um l less recoil fighting line had a bug where it was doing way more damage than intended that's getting fixed thunderlord that's getting fixed there's a bug that made it uh crit twice instead of once with divinity um, and here's some perks, perk changes, uh, fragile focus. Uh, you, you can read this if you, if you just want to, just want to read it. I'm just going through it, uh, quickly. Um, but here's all the perk changes. And finally, uh, for the next TWABs in the future and all the big, uh, updates later, there's a sword update coming with a goal of making guarding substantially more valuable. I mean, I personally don't really guard with swords. I think it's not worth it, but hopefully this will change that. And they're going to work on an update to Sparrows that will allow players to use their favorites instead of always on time without nerfing always on time itself. So thank you for watching. Uh, put, you know, comment down below what your favorite change on this TWAB is. Uh, I, you know, it's got to be sweet business for me. I'm so excited for that. Uh, leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed and I'll catch you in the next one.